Have you ever wondered how a collective effort can transform a community or even the world? Let's embark on a journey with Adrian, an ambitious astronaut who aimed for the stars. He spent years preparing for a space mission that promised to take him closer to the cosmos than anyone before. The vastness of space was his dream, his passion, his ultimate destination. But as fate would have it, a medical complication arose, grounding him just a week before the launch. Dreams of the cosmos crumbled, replaced by a feeling of despair. In this moment of disappointment, Adrian retreated to his childhood home, a tranquil haven nestled amongst the mountains. Far from the glittering spectacle of the stars he yearned to explore, he found himself grounded by circumstances. Yet, in the face of shattered dreams, Adrian found solace in the serene environment of his childhood home. Just when we think our dreams have been crushed, sometimes life opens up a new universe for us to explore. Meet Clara, a passionate environmentalist who has dedicated her life to documenting the region's flora and fauna. With a keen eye for the intricate weave of life, she guides Adrian, the grounded astronaut, through the winding paths of the local ecosystem. At first, Adrian was dismissive. He had spent years gazing at the stars, dreaming of the cosmos' vastness, the delicate flutter of a butterfly's wings, the silent growth of plants, the gentle hum of the Earth's rhythm. These were far removed from his grandiose dreams. But Clara, patient and persistent, continued to share her world with Adrian. She showed him the dance of butterflies, a dance as complex and beautiful as the swirl of galaxies. She introduced him to the silent growth of plants, life unfolding at a pace that demanded patience and appreciation. And then there was the glow of fireflies, tiny beacons that lit up the night, a spectacle as breathtaking as a sky full of stars. Clara shared her philosophy with Adrian, a perspective that would change his outlook forever. Sometimes the universe isn't out there in the vastness, she said. It's here in the minute details waiting to be discovered. These words echoed in Adrian's mind, resonating with the truth he had overlooked in his quest for the stars. Slowly, Adrian began to see the world through Clara's eyes. He started to appreciate the dance of butterflies, the silent growth of plants, the glow of fireflies. He saw the universe not just in the distant galaxies, but in the palm of his hand, in the patterns of leaves, in the rhythm of the Earth. Adrian, the astronaut grounded from space, found a new universe to explore. He discovered that wonder, that sense of awe and fascination, wasn't confined to the cosmos. It was all around him, in the details of life on our beautiful Earth. Adrian, although grounded from space, found a new universe to explore, realizing that wonder wasn't just in the distant galaxies, but right here on our beautiful Earth. Like Adrian, we too can find our universe in the service of our community and collective efforts. Just as Adrian discovered the intricate beauty of nature in his own backyard, we too can uncover profound value and significance in our own communities. The rhythm of the earth that Adrian found is not unlike the rhythm of a community working together, each individual contributing their unique abilities and strengths. It's a dance of collaboration, much like the dance of butterflies Clara showed Adrian, working together in service of our community, paying attention to the minutiae, the small acts of kindness and cooperation, we can create a significant impact. Just as Adrian found a universe in the glow of fireflies and the patterns of leaves, we can find our own universe in the smiles of those we help, the gratitude of those we serve and the progress we make together. So remember, every small act of service, every collective effort contributes to the grandeur and beauty of our world, much like every star adds to the splendor of the cosmos.